What's up, everybody? It's Profit Gaming here, and we're back with another episode of Death Stranding Director's Cut. This is part 41, and we just defeated Higgs, but the story's not over yet. Uh, we have to go across the country back to where we came from because um, Fragile cannot transport us to the beach to save Amelie. So we have to get close enough to the beach to where it's not um, too strenuous on her body because all the people that she has uh, teleported um, has definitely took a toll on her body. So I have to go all the way across country. So let's not waste any time, y'all. Let's get it. Cheer. All right, let's get out of here. Can I get a bike or something? I need something, man. Uh oh. Another vision. Child special. One of a kind. Yes, he is. That's my baby. A baby cat it did. Either that or a sacrifice. Ugly mask off your face. Take that ugly mask off your face, lady. Or is that your real face? <laughs> Die hard, man. Okay, chapter 10, y'all. Episode 10. Let's get it. Whoa, broski. What? Wait, what? I am so confused. Lake Knot City. Uh. Alright, hold up. We gotta go back in. Or right, let me at least go to the private locker. Hold on, hold on. Where's my equipment? No, 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 no. No, no, no. What? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ho, oh, oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. Merry Christmas. Um, bridge boots? That's it? Y'all are trying to play me, man. That's it. Y'all are trying to play me. Fabrication, man. Yeah, yeah, they, they trying to play me. Look at this. They tried to play a brother. Let me tell you. Y'all, first of all, I'm going to need non-lethals. I'm going to need two of these Johns, man. And then, Mazer gun. Eh. Check it out. Let's get the handgun. No, it's not non-lethal, though. Where is it? Riot shotgun. You know what? Let's try a grenade launcher too. I'll, I'll let's get that on. Get two of these. And oh, looky there. Let's use this. Yes, special delivery. Let's get it. So equip it. Um, hang on to a rack. Uh, carry on back, carry on back. You know what? Attach this to the suit, man. Wait a minute. First of all, you know what else I need? Armor plates, man. Let's get those armor plates going. And gloves. <clears throat> all right. Now we're ready. Now, that's the suit. Yep. Um, put on gloves. Let's get it. Cheer. We out. All right. Where's my bike, man? Ah, yes. But of course. Now. They said lake now, right? Is that where I was supposed to go? Hello? Sam, it's Hartman. Be advised that chiral density in regions predisposed to strandings has increased dramatically. No doubt the beach is to blame. PTs drawn into our world under these circumstances may be affected in unpredictable ways. Okay. This guy don't look right. 
Yeah, they look green. What should I do now? It's nothing. Six that what? Oh my god. We got music playing and all that popping off. Uh, uh. Oh, this should be fun. Obviously, right? I'm gonna get there, but keep going. Six thousand, man. That's something else. Whoa, I'm spinning out of control out here in these streets. I love the music, though. You gotta love it. Wow, that's beautiful music. Obviously, I'm going to get hit with a copyright. <laughs> it's all good, though. I'm not monetized yet, so it doesn't matter to me. Whoa. Oh. Oh, not this shit again. Wow, look at all the stuff that's been dropped. Fascinating. Yeah, 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 sure, 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 buddy. I'm not here to fight. I got to roll, baby. You can get knocked out in these streets. Don't play with me. But if a fight is what you, if a fight is what you want, bring it on, baby. Oh, 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 bro, chill, chill. <laughs> Go back. Ow. Oh, not the snow. How far away am I now? Oh, 5,000? God damn. What about here? Oh, winter clothes, eh? I don't care. Like ain't gonna last, man. But it'll, it'll get me as far as I need to go, unless there's a charging station. Otherwise, we are screwed. Yeah. Five thousand still. Jeez. Imagine that. My lord. Check my map. Wow. America, America. Uh, I might have to go around this, John. Let's go this way. charging station what is this oh, hmm. oh that's a UCLA nice to see y'all man okay so far so good yeah, I know. My bike is going out. I get it. Boom. Okay. The jingle bell. Ching, ching, ching. Let me see. How far am I? 
My goodness. Hello? Sam, do you copy? Yes. I've been looking into Clifford Unger and wanted to share my thoughts. To recap, Unger was a U.S. Special Forces operative mm -hmm. whose retirement roughly coincided with the Death Stranding. Okay. After he left the service, he somehow became involved in the early BB experiments. All right. However, he died before they ended. Now, while the circumstances surrounding his death are not entirely clear, I'm beginning to suspect that these battlefields of his are at least partially sustained by his enduring emotional attachments. Anger, resentment, regret. I'm pretty sure it's got something to do with the BB experiments. That much seems clear given his repeated attempts to steal Lou. Mm. Cliff seems to be driven by a compulsion to reclaim our BB, as if that will make him whole again. A compulsion so powerful that he was not only able to drag himself from the depths of hell, but bring a piece of that hell along with him. Whoa. One thing's for sure, he's nothing like a BT. We need to know the whole story about his death and his connection to the BB experiments. I'll keep digging and let you know what I find, Sam. I bet. Thanks, man. You're the best. He's the best. So as I progress further, I guess he's going to find more information. Seems like. Oh, wow. Come on, man. Don't give me that. Bite guys out. Crap. I need to charge, man. I could look at my map, but I'm just too lazy. Yeah, I know. Do I have a PC? I do. I literally could just... Oh, no. Not this shit. Screw it. BB, wake up, man. Wake your ass up, BB. Well, anyway. Oh, no. There we go. I wake their ass up. I'm gonna blow these punks out the water. Give me my medic grenade. Man. I can still take my bike, right? I don't know. Whatever. I need a bike. Go ahead, BTs. Act up. Act a fool. I'm ready for it. I'm strapped. Ooh, nice. Someone done left me a bike over here, man. Let's see. Let's go this way. Nice and easy. I'm glad a bike was left there. <laughs> Nice, we got out. We got out. Yay! Baby, we did it. Yay, baby. And now look, look where we at. Four thousand. We can do this, man. Cross country. Let's go. Wow. This is absolutely stunning. What I'm witnessing. Oh. Easy now. Don't break the thing. Uh, uh, uh. Wow. A lot of rocks. How deep does this rabbit hole go, man? Can I get up this way? Probably. Let's go! I feel like Batman, the Dark Knight. 
so fire, man. Damn you. Oh. Okay. I'm not. <laughs> Get that rainbow. Taste the rainbow, good. Oh, wow. All these rocks. God damn it. You know what? There we go. It's a lot better. Goldberg. No way. Where are we now? Huh. Interesting. Let me see, where, where is this? Oh, 3,000. Very nice. Sam. Yes? You're not going to believe what I found. Okay. It's about the BB experiments, their true purpose. According to official records, they were continued in secret on the order of President Strand. Supposedly with the primary objective of developing PT detectors and preventing void outs. Any advancements that could be applied to the fields of chiral communications and beach research were meant to be of purely secondary benefit. Hmm. But it turns out that's just a cover story. Okay. The truth cover girl. is that BBs were originally conceived as catalysts for the operation of the chiral network. Hmm. They're integrated into the infrastructure of not cities for that very reason. Every single one you've brought into the fold. Mm -hmm. It was probably Amelie herself who installed them as she moved west with the first expedition, carrying out her mother's grand plan, hmm. making sacrifice after sacrifice on the altar of progress. What? President Strand told the people what they wanted to hear and did what she thought had to be done. Hmm. Also, America could be whole again. But I'm starting to wonder if it didn't cost her her soul. Hmm. The chiral network is our greatest creation, our proudest achievement. And our guilty as sin. Wow. I don't know how to feel about it all. Interesting. Maybe if we knew more about Cliff and the BB experiments, we'd be better placed to judge. Yeah. I'll be in touch. Alright, man. Thanks. Appreciate it. Boss. Boss. <clears throat> it's not raining anymore, which is good. <clears throat> Oh, I spoke too soon. <laughs> Your boy spoke too soon. I don't even know where I'm at anymore. Just keep swimming. Just keep Wait a minute. This looks familiar. This looks actually pretty familiar. Bola gun, huh? It's a lot of stuff going on over here. Let me get across this water here. It looks promising. Yeah, that's not looking good. No, can't cross. No way. Mm -mm. Nope. No, 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 no. I know where we're at now. Can I drive on this? No, of course not. They don't make it that easy, do they? Ugh. Okay. Okay, whatever. Screw the bike, man. I'll get another one. We'll get there. Who likes that? Someone's happy. Oh yeah. My little precious baby. Yeah, we're almost there, man. Almost there. We 
We've got the speed boots. Let's get it. Mm -hmm. Can this take us somewhere? Probably not. Matter of fact, hold up. Let's try it. Someone's happy. Got nothing. A lot of rain. Yeah, we're very close. drop right there. No. What the hell? How many of them are there? Hold up. Check me out. They want to fight, right? Fuck it. I'm not fighting these dudes yet. Screw you. Oh, no. baby. Yep. Where's the other one at? Come on, asshole. Yep. Is there something you want? This ain't what you want, baby.
Thank you. Give me that damn Cairo crystal, boy. Yes. I know Lou's happy. I'm happy. Everybody's happy. Yay. Yes, well, yes. Absolutely. Any more? Wow. Just marvelous. All right, we out. Let's get out of here, Blue. Two thousand each. We can do it. Just gonna take a while. You know, I'm thinking we might finish this game tonight. I don't know. We'll see. Chromatic grenades, huh? It's like a puzzle. It's like a maze, not a puzzle. Walking through this, John. Yo, I need um to charge up my legs here, man. Whoa. Easy. Okay, we're good. <laughs> BB is so cute. Hey, bub. What's up? Yeah. So this ain't it. But I can charge, though. Charge some legs, man. Maybe I can get a bike. Because now I know where I'm at. Finally. Probably like fabricate a bike or something. It's good enough for me, man. Give me a bike. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Thank you, sir. Garage. Let's see what we got. Ah, uh, yes. I'll take that. Thank you. <laughs> Look at that, man. Got bikes everywhere, cuz. Alright, I know where to go now. I know exactly where to go now, man. Oh yeah? Is that right? I can go up here, right? Let's see. It's tough, but we'll get there. I didn't want to go on that water. Oh, God. Yeah, we're good. What's that road? Right there. Ooh. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. We're almost there. Thank you. Mad rain, bro. It's intense. Bet you none of the, um... What's it called? The enemy type. What are they? What are their names again? Oh, they are outside. Jeez. What do you call those guys again? Mules. Yeah. I thought they weren't going to be out there, but they're out there. 
Rain, sleet, hail, snow to get their cargo. <laughs> that rhymes. Rain, sleet, hail, snow to get their cargo. Ooh. Nice bike, man. Don't need it, though. This game is so fascinating, man. I'm glad that I experienced this. I, I hope that you guys can experience this, too, man. What's hey, this? Sam. Yep. I see you're coming up on Lake Nun. That's right. Stay strong. We're all rooting for you to finish the job and come home safe. Be coming. By the way, I've made more progress in a certain investigation. Okay. It seems that Clifford Unger willingly put his own child in the care of the scientists conducting the BB experiments. That's horrible. But he did so completely unaware of their true intentions. Oh. This is pure speculation. Okay. But I think when Cliff found out about their plans, he attempted to reclaim custody. Mm. And after he failed, the BB remained in the program's care. Wow. In which case, he would have every reason to bear a grudge towards the president. The mm. woman who allowed it all to happen, don't you think? But just because President Strand is dead, doesn't mean his hate died with her. No, I think he redirected it towards Bridges. Mm. Towards you and Amelie and anyone close to the director. And now that hate is driving him to set in motion the last stranding, to bring an end to the world as we know it. Hmm. Why else would Cliff hold Amelie hostage on the beach? He must know that she's an EE. Interesting. There's no time to lose. You have to save her and the director. Gotcha. Though I still don't understand how he managed to travel to her beach in the first place. He's there a must beast, be more man. to their relationship. I'll see what I can find. All right, bet. Please do, man. Seek and you shall find. Whoa, look at that, guys. What am I heading into? The mules are desperate, man. They don't get it. Why would you be out here during a storm like this? Okay, guys, whatever. Look at that storm, man. That's bonkers. Got a moment, Sam? No. It's about the director. So there's no way he could have made the jump to Amelie's beach if they didn't share a strong personal connection, right? Hmm. Well, I looked, and I couldn't see one. Interesting. The network should have contained something, anything, but there was nothing whatsoever. His entire life prior to his tenure with Bridges has been redacted. Hmm. His name, his past, everything. There's no telling who he was. Wow. Which led me to consider another possibility. Hmm. What if it isn't the director and Amelie who have a connection, but the director and Clifford Unger? And what if that connection is what facilitated the director's jump to Amelie's beach? Hmm. If it's those two who have a personal history, then it might explain why Cliff is holding the director hostage as well. Interesting. But even if that were the case, it doesn't answer the bigger question. How the hell did the two of them end up on Amelie's beach? Right. Sam, Hartman here. So. There's something else I'd like you to consider. Mm -hmm. A guess, albeit an educated one, concerning Cliff's objective. Somehow, with the aid of the chiral network, our individual beaches have begun to coalesce, resulting in the formation of a single massive seam. Yep, I see it. Should this process continue, there is a risk that BTs will flood across into our world, mm. bringing about a death stranding on a heretofore unprecedented scale. Heretofore. Now, Clifford <laughs> Unger's battlefields and my own beach appear to be unaffected by this phenomenon, existing entirely in isolation. Mm. They do not and have never intersected with others. But what if there were another class of beach? Hmm. One that exists on a higher plane that was responsible for setting this process in motion. Okay. And what if the beach in question were none other than Armonies? Okay. Cliff may have summoned the director, but I believe his true aim was to seize control of Armonies Beach. Hmm. To exploit its power over every other beach and trigger the last stranding. It's the only rational explanation for Cliff's actions, mm. which is why you have to stop him. If Hartman's right, then we're in serious trouble. 
using the chiral network in Amelie's beach to trigger the last stranding? That's why Higgs went after Amelie, wasn't it? If it was Cliff who put him up to it. Yeah, it all fits. With the last stranding, he'll finally have his revenge against the world that stole his life and his child. Mm. You've got to stop him, Sam. You've got to make the jump to Amelie's beach as soon as possible. Got you. Get in and get her back. It's our only hope. If you can't, then we're all doomed. Dooms? See what I just did there? We're all dooms. Sorry, man. Sorry about it. I'll be out here dying in the streets. I made the same mistake. Shoot him. Wow. It's horrible, man. Mm. Ooh. This gangster, man. He's on the beach. Who's that retarded baby? really want to get clapped son I am not for the games man. so get let's get it I'm ready welcome to the jungle wow click my vision excuse me Clifford Unger Bring it on, punk. Wake up, Sam. Where's my equipment? I'm all equipmentless. Sucks. Where's my stuff, man? Oh, there it is. 
escape the battlefield again. Cargo. No. What? All right, we good, man. Let's get it. I gotta go this way. Obviously. I gotta win this time. No. Wow. Really blew my eardrums out, man. What? Don't worry, Lou. Don't worry. You'll be alright. You'll be alright. You'll be alright. This is getting on. I do wrong. Hold up. Blood bag. Okay, we're good. Let's get this over with. Sucker. Ghost. This is beautiful. Oh, ow. Ooh. Ooh, ow. What the hell? A little crack, baby. Man, get that thing out of here. Crack, baby. Right in the goo, baby. Man, I'm ready for whatever he got. What's up, soldier? Let's get bodied, son. You are about to get bodied, Clifford. The red dog. He's over here just smoking, puffing, puffing on cancer stick, man. <laughs> I got you. Don't worry, you disease. Pass on me. Oh, he can just stay in the fire like that? Man, that's G'd up. That is G'd up, I must say. Yeah, bring it on, man. Whatever. Like I like I care. Like I'm scared of your old punk ass. Got him. Hey. See ya. I thought you had the drop. Thought he had the drop on me, man. What just happened? Hold up. Who 
to shoot at me. Okay. Wait. Wait for it. Is that old boy? I think that's old boy. Yeah, run, coward. He's scared, man. Look at him. get bodied out here man don't play with me you know that hold up me one of them cryo bites I can't we need, we need reinforcements well grab them up get your reinforcements buddy grab your reinforcements buddy like I'm scared please there they go yeah, okay, buddy. Body bag. Got him. Right in the face. Body bag. Body bag. Easy work. Oh, that's homie. Hold up. Hold up, man. Yeah, run. Coward. Body bag. Strong regroup. Yeah, regroup. I'm gonna whoop that ass. Then what? We need, we need reinforcements. I know you do. Who? I see his ass. Shotgun? It's over. Say your prayers. Yeah, okay. Open fire. Good night. Open fire on that.
What's the matter, buddy? <laughs> I mean, what a bum. Good night. Easy work, man. Hey, go to sleep, man. <laughs> go to sleep, cuz. Why you did it? That's a nice scene. I'm not going to lie. Oh. BB safe. BB. We're getting out of here. I promise. Give me back my baby. Are you clear of hunger? Sam Porter Bridges. Are you the father? Oh, poor baby. Don't cry. <laughs> the baby's so cute. That's cute. They told me your name was Sam Porter. Mm hmm. That's right. When you were Sam Bridges. Mm. My bridge to the future. Hmm. My bridge to the future. What does he mean by that? Sam, you bring people together. Mm. You're their bridge to the future. Mm. Come on, Sam. Stand up. Mm. This is a powerful scene.
Did he just give him his dark tax? That's crazy. Hmm. There you go, man. I'll take the dog tag. You take the baby. I'm not babysitting anymore. Here. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, thanks, man. Yeah, BB safe. What's going on? Why is he hugging me now? Yo, put, put that baby back, man. Make things right. Make things back right now. What the hell? What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Take her, BB, and get out of this place. That's, uh... There's nothing I can do for your wife. I'm sorry. Hmm. He orders me to do something. I have to do it. I have to. Why? But I served under you first. Your family doesn't deserve this. Any of this. Why are you helping me? They catch you. Because you saved my life, sir. Again and again. When the brass sent us into the jaws of hell, it was you that brought us home. Huh? Word? Bring my baby back, my baby. I like that. Oh. Sam just keep elevating. What's up now? Hmm? Sam's crying, crying. What's up, a BB, man? System error. Sam, yes. Uh, are you okay? Are you okay? I reviewed your logs. It looks like you were caught in a supercell. Yeah, it looks like. And emerged an instant later on the other side of Ground Zero. Not far from Port Nod City. Hmm. How'd I wind up here then? Remember Victor? He found you lying unconscious by the harbor and brought you inside. Hmm. I think Cliff might be Lou's father. Yeah, he is. Give me back my baby. Impossible. Cliff was born. He gave me this. Maybe he's trying to tell us something. What is he trying something to tell us? Something about the BBs, maybe. About how they were made. Mm. It didn't feel like he was trying to hurt us. Mm. It felt like, like he just wanted to talk. Mm. But you said you saw him holding the director captive on the beach. Yeah. They must have some history we don't know about. That man, Bridget. Funny you should say that. I've got something you should see. Okay. Found it in the archives while I was digging around. It's a pre-recorded message from the director labeled, If I Don't Come Back. Okay. This message is insurance, in case something happens to me. Mm. For Bridget's eyes only. And I sure as hell hope that's who's watching. Mm. I got a little present from Amelie. Said she'd take me to the beach if I wanted. But I'd need this doll to show me the way. Mm. It's a trap. It has to be. But I've decided to play along. Mm. You've all been playing along too, haven't you? You know this mask hides more than just my face. Oh, shit. Well, 
Emily's a blank slate, too. No past, no record she ever existed. She's a ghost. And the thing about ghosts, I never met Emily in person. Have you? Ever seen her in the flesh, shook her hand, touched her? Hmm. The original team we sent was divided into two groups. Mm -hmm. Emily was with the first, Mama and Hartman were with the second. They had no direct contact with her. Hmm. Yes, Amelie's group was wiped out in Edge North City. Everyone but her. Everyone who could say whether or not she exists. Bullshit. She's real. We touched, all right? She and I both. Well, I've only ever interacted with her hologram. I'm telling you, I've met her. In person. Lots of times when I was little. Yes, but on the beach. Here's what the president had to say about her daughter. Emily was born on the beach. There her ka remained, though her ha came to this world. Hmm. This division of body and soul forced her to spend most of her childhood in the hospital. But though her health was poor, her doom's numbers were off the charts. Her supernatural talents blossomed as she grew older and overcame her limitations. Hmm. But by the time she was 20, she could travel to and from the beach, body and all. Hmm. And that's where she started spending all of her time. Hmm. Now, if you wanted to get in touch with Emily, it was by a hologram or nothing. The president insisted on that. I swore an oath to the president and to America. Far as I was concerned, her word was law. Hmm. So when she said Amelie was her daughter and the best candidate to succeed her, I believed it. But when the archives were restored, I couldn't resist testing out my access privileges. And that's how I found out. Bridget was diagnosed with uterine cancer in her 20s and couldn't have children. You see? Doesn't add up, does it? Mm. There's no way Emily could be Bridget's biological daughter. Right. So where'd she come from? Who is she? Is she even real? How can we be sure that Emily is an extinction entity when we don't even know if Emily is Emily? Hell, for all I know, the EE -E theory might be bullshit. But if it's not, if she's the cause of the Death Stranding, then I have to accept her invitation. I've loaded my gun with hermetic rounds. Sam's blood. It connects my gun to her, to me, hmm. to him, all of us. Is that how he was able to... Means to the beach? I should be able to take it with me to the beach. Hmm. I'm gonna stop what she started by stopping her. Hmm. One last confession. I'm just a man. No powers. Nothing special. Don't have dooms. I can't repatriate like Sam either. Hmm. Don't know the first thing about dying. I had never tried it. been to hell every single battlefield was hell but no matter how terrible it got I never died because all I ever did was run from death well I gotta go she's calling for me bridges don't let me down. Hmm. Wow. Okay. So what now? After he recorded this, the director jumped to the beach. Or rather, Amelie summoned him there. He had a gun to Bridget when I saw him. Then Cliff showed up, took him away. I thought he went to the beach to confront Amelie. Yeah, she was there too. 
She was the one who got me out. Huh. It's so obvious to me now. I can't believe I didn't see it sooner. It was Omri who... What? No stinking way. What happened? The chiral network dropped out. According to Lakna, it won't be long before it's completely unusable. So all our hard work was for nothing. Let me finish what I was saying, sir. I'll tell him. Fraja. Virgile. You look like shit. You should be resting. I know. I need to tell you something. What's that? You pregnant? I had a little chat with Higgs back on the beach. Didn't take much to make him talk. He say why he betrayed you. He said it was part of her plan. What? She was their leader. What? The terrorist void outs, the whole extinction agenda. Amelie was behind it all. What? Like how she was. I know you don't want to believe it, but it lines up with what Die Hard Man said. Mm. He's turned on me after he met Amelie. At first, he was looking to expand his territory, and I had a power he could use. At least, that's how he ended up working with me. He was no terrorist. He just wanted to reach more people. Mm. But then she shows up with abilities that put mine to shame. Hell, she could even control BTs. Mm. So Higgs decides to go with her. Mm. And that's when she turned him into her agent of extinction. Well, Amelie gave Higgs his power. Yep, she made him her homo demons. What about Bridget? Homo you gotta tell me what she was doing on the beach. You got an answer for that too. I know it's a lot to swallow. But he said himself that Amelie is an extinction entity. I looked inside his pod, and there was no BB in there. Hmm. Take a good look at what was. It's the same doll Die Hard Man had. Hmm. This is their bridge baby. There's this idea that the terrorists brought back BB Tech and Bridges was just following suit. It's garbage. Their methods and yours are completely different. Your BB links you to the world of the dead. Their doll links them to Amelie and her beach. Mm. You know who else had dolls like this? Cliff. He was carrying them on the battlefields. Mm, he was. Cliff. Higgs. The director. All three of them were drawn in and controlled by this extinction entity. And who is this EE -E really? Is it Bridget? Is it Amelie? All I can say is that the answers are on the beach. What she wants and why. Mm. If we get to the bottom of that, then maybe we can still avert the last stranding. You've got to find her, Sam. Whoever she really is. <sighs> Waiting for you on the beach. Hurry back east. Right. Come on, guys. Well, I'm gonna save here, guys. Wow. Wow, man. Alright, man. Let me just save. Hello? Sam, the connection's unstable, so I'll keep this short. We have a job for you. Rajan's condition is deteriorating. If she slips into a coma, there's a chance her soul might become stranded on the beach. Mm. She needs crypto bios fast. Luckily for us, Fragile Express keeps a stockpile there in Port Nord City. So we'd like you to grab some for us while you're in the area. Okay. All the details are on the terminal upstairs. Please, Sam. This is critical. Okay. Okay. Hold up. All right, man. Listen, y'all. Thank you for tuning into this episode of uh, Death Stranding. We're almost done with the game, man. I feel it, man, in my soul. Listen, thank you, guys. And I will see you guys in the next episode. And if you're new to the channel, man, you know what to do. Like, comment, and subscribe. 
And stay tuned because we got another episode coming up, man. I'll see you guys. Love you guys. We out of here. Peace.